I'm sure some of us have experienced this at a sleepover. So, do you want to do something? No. Well, fear no more. I'm Mariella, and this is How to Host a Sleepover. One to four friends, a way to contact your friends, your favorite snacks and drinks, fun things to do for the stations, music, something to watch a movie on, a movie, and an alarm clock. Step one, invite one to four friends over. Step two, set up a food and drink bar with lots of different snacks and drinks. Step three, set up different stations around your house with lots of fun things to do. Step four, ask opinions on dinner, breakfast, and movies from your guests. Step five, put on fun, upbeat music. <laughs> When your guests arrive, take their bags and bring them to your room. Hey. <laughs> take your bag. <laughs> Come. Okay, this is optional. If your friends haven't seen your house, give them a tour of your house. Also, let your friends snack on the food you put out. Watch a movie that everyone agrees on. Nice. Okay. agree on the movie. You don't want this happening. Oh my god, I didn't want to watch this movie. You're not my friend anymore. <sighs> set an alarm for the morning. Siri, set an alarm for 7.01 a.m. After you've watched the movie and eaten dinner, it'll probably be about time to go to sleep. But you want to go to sleep at a reasonable time, not any time later than 12. Andy, didn't you hear the alarm? Wake up! Oh, I'm going back to sleep. The first thing you want to do in the morning is make sure everyone is packed up so you have more time to have fun. When your guests leave, compliment them on how good of guests they were. Wait, wait. video i hope you enjoyed it and now i hope you feel inspired to go host a sleepover and yeah goodbye Hooray! <laughs> what step four uh... i'm sure some of us has a <laughs> <laughs> watch a movie that everyone agrees get out Okay. Uh.